Let's see. I think I'm live. There we go. Good morning, Thursday morning. Thursday the 5th, the day after the 4th, which is for some people. It was just a Wednesday. Uh, but for some of us crazy people here in the U.S., it was a day to scare the bejesus out of people. Um, we actually had our fireworks on Tuesday night. And so we sat out and watched them. And then yesterday, uh, some neighbor people were setting off fireworks and scared my poor little kitty cat. Hi, Robin. Good morning. Uh, I'm just going to wait for some people to come in. Um, I was going to work on the fairy messenger today. I need to finish some, some works in progress. Um, I'm actually going to flip through some of them. So while I wait for some people to get on, hi Kimberly, it's showing I have no people watching right now, which is really kind of funny. Um, so while I'm waiting for people to get on, I'm just going to work on this a um, little bit, and then I'll go through all of my works in progress, have a chatty chat, and uh try to wake up because my cat woke me up at 6 a.m. for, you know, no dang good reason. Other than she wanted to. Hi, Emily. Hi, May. I need to turn my computer here. There we go. Now I can see it. How's everybody doing? My, I know I'm a little early. I'm jumping the gun. Like I said, I've been up since 6 a.m., was the cat she wanted to play and by play she meant you know attack my feet and climb up the side of my leg and generally be a nuisance and not play with her actual toys so you know hi Teresa how are you well let just a few more come in here but I've got to finish something you ever get to that point where you're like I have too much going on I have too many whips I have too much stuff I just I gotta finish something I'm currently at that point nope I can't I can't work on anything else I can't open anything else I can't do anything else I have to finish so Oh, we've got about eight here. So I'll go through my current, that's my testy paper. So this is Elm Just Nova, my favorite book of all time. Uh, let's see. I'm still working on the fairy door page. Just going to pick up. Aww. I'm sorry, Emily. So this is the fairy door page I was working with the whole binds on. So I need to finish this up. Um, I don't actually like the whole binds in this pa paper. It's okay for some, but like the green, I wasn't digging it. Maybe I just need to put more on. But I was using Gamsol to, to do it. Let's see. I've got these two. So this was Derwent Artist pencils. I was like, oh, I'm going to use... Hi, Kenneth. I was like, oh, I'm going to use Derwent Artist, except, God, I hate them. Zoe? Oh, my God, did she just wake up? I suppose I should have checked on that, huh? Good morning, sunshine. I'm doing my recording now. Good morning, sunshine. Hi. Love you. Love you too. You can get your tablet. Yay. Yeah. Because I went to play in, in our fun land on Minecraft. You can go do that. But Kelly said later. 
Oh, if Kaylee doesn't want to play, then you can't make somebody else play a game they don't want to, okay? So find something else to do until she wants to play that game with you, okay? Okay. And then this one I was doing, t sorry about that. Well, it's a little late for to get breakfast, honey. You have to see if Kaylee can get you some cereal, okay? More pancakes. There are no more pancakes unless you want the blueberry ones, and she can't reach the microwave. Oh, good morning. Um, yeah, this I was working with Tombos trying to figure it all out. I don't know how I'm going to do that. But I've got to finish these. I'm telling you guys, this is ridiculous. It's ridiculous. I still have the Ice Queen I have to finish. I have mostly, I think I just have her and the castle left. I think I've done everything else, believe it or not. It may not look like it, but I was trying to go for... I don't even know if you can see that. That's terrible. So, it's kind of like colored. See, I use yellow, pink, blue, and I think that's it. Yellow, pink, and blue. It's terrible. Hi, Cheshire. See, this is in progress between Tombos and Polychromos. Uh, this one's still in progress. I was using, uh, oh goodness, what was that? The Koei Noors. I was using Koei Noors. See, I know there's more. This one's still in progress. This is Prismacolor, and I did a Neo background. And this is just, I like have five more books here, guys. And this is in progress. This is Prisma, or no, not Prisma colors. Polychromos. And I'm going over the um, the dragon with some Tombos. I'm not making anything. I said you could have cereal. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. That's what you may have. Would you like me to get you the cereal? Oh, pardon me for a second. I need to have a discussion with my kid. I said no. I said you could have cereal and you could have your sister come get it. That's it. Nothing else. Do you understand? I say one thing and then they try for absolutely everything but that one thing yeah I'm not having a good morning um, see what else? I know there's something else. Is it just the one I'm working on now? It might be. Oh no, the. So then there's this one. And then there's this one. So those are all my current whips in this, in this book. That I have to finish. But I'm also working in Forest Girl. So uh, this is the page Tess and I are doing for the mentorship program, for Anne's mentorship program. I'm way behind her. She's got so much more done. Um, but I've done like little bits to show her. And I need to finish it up. Because I think this page is really super cute. And I'd like to see it done. I'm out of room. And then I'm working in Ivy and Inky Butterfly because aren't I always on this double page spread. Uh, I was using pit pens and the Artezas. 
which I don't really like them. I don't really like the Artezas on this paper, but the pit pens are very nice. Really like them. And then if you're in my Facebook group, you saw this page started because somebody was asking how you start a blank page. Um, and it's, it's, I was trying to explain that it's very much different for each page. This one, I knew I wanted the green gold background and muted colors. So I started with the green gold background because I knew that color. Um, but, you know, each page is different. That's just how I started this one. Um, I'm using the Lyra Rembrandt so far. And then, of course, the sword page in Phantomorphia. I did manage to finish the Sword of Life, and she said this was Sword X, whatever she means by that. But so I've finished all the shading on all the tree root parts, so now I'm working on the swords. Kind of slow going, a uh, mixture of pencils and markers and kind of whatever else. This is going to be um, another silver and green. But it won't be this green, it'll be a darker green. Yes, ma'am. You decided to have cereal? Yes. One second, let me get her cereal. Oh my goodness, me oh my, okay. Hopefully that's the last interruption. I could really go back to sleep, guys. I have not been sleeping very well for days and it's driving me bonkers and I hate it. I get, like, my Fitbit will tell me, oh yeah, you got like eight hours of sleep. But I'll have, you know, ten minutes of REM sleep or deep sleep. And that's nothing so I'm not actually getting very good sleep and then I'm working in Botanicum on this page with um, ink tents and Albrecht Dürer's so I was inspired by Zargot doing all of her stuff so this is all shaded with ink tents and it's all shaded with Albrecht Dürer's and it is not going through it's buckling a little bit but it's not going through. And I'm digging this page, but I'm just working on it slowly. And then the last one that I've got going is this page from Friends of Nature. What is it? It's the it's the angler page, right? I've got that one too. Beast beast so I was watercoloring on this too thank you May I just need to I really just need to finish her hair and maybe shade a little bit more 
on her fins and stuff. And then I might be done and do his teeth. So I think he's done. I like him. So that's currently what I'm it's currently what I'm working on. But I'm trying to finish. I really am. So I'm gonna zoom in here and just start working. If y'all got any questions, stories, I don't know. Whatevs. The colors I'm using again are the coral white, passion fruit, blood orange, and marmalade from the Arteza expert line. Hi, Shaleen. My my books buckle, um, Kenneth. They buckle. But so what I end up doing is I will take a badly buckled page. Like this page is pretty well buckled. Let me zoom back out. This page is pretty well buckled. I, I've used a lot of water on it. You can see all the buckling here. What I'll end up doing is if I wanted to go over with pencil, if it's just watercolor, it doesn't bother me. But if I wanted to go over with pencil, it actually does bother me. So what I take is a dishcloth and I lay it over the top of the page and I legit take my iron, my clothing iron. I turn it on cotton because that's the cloth I have on there. And I don't steam it though, don't turn it on steam. And then I just, I legit iron the page out. And that's all I do. <laughs> like if it buckles really bad, I iron my page. And that's seriously all I do. Thank you, Robin. It's okay, honey. I'm exhausted today too, sweetie. Don't even worry about it. I'm tired. So if I sound off, I'm sorry. But yeah, Kenneth, iron your page. <laughs> Just iron it. Um, I think it was coloring with Elena said she did that. And I was like, seriously, you just iron your page? I tried it. Sure enough. I mean, it may take a couple goes. Um, if it's really, really bad and it's not ironing out, I will stack books on top of it. I've got a lot of books. I've got a lot of heavy books. So I will stack books on top of it if I need it to flatten out even more. But yeah, ironing tends to work pretty well. Believe it or not. And if you are feeling adventurous and you don't have it on a high setting, you could even do it straight on the page. But I don't necessarily recommend that. I would definitely put something between. Something you would normally iron like a piece of clothing, a, a t-shirt or a dishcloth or something of that nature where you have a, that barrier between the the paper page. Do you need the spray for her? Is she getting on? Oh, honey, she's in such a mood today. That cat is on a toe biting fetish and it is really driving me up the flipping wall. Yeah, feel free to ask me anything. I'm not really, I don't really have any tutorial -y type stuff to show today. If you got questions, holler them out. Do my best to answer. I'm just trying to get some stuff done, dang it. I feel very almost overwhelmed with how many whips I've got. So I've got to get some of these done. And I've got to mow my lawn. Blech. Hi April, how are you? I 
I do want to do though is where's my black? Just a little bit. Oh, I'm so tired of the toes, Shaleen. Oh, it's so annoying. If, if she's not biting toes, then she is licking hair and biting hair, and I just can't. Oh, thanks, April. I'm kind of in a bleh. I feel so tired. I feel so, like... It's that exhaustion where you you may have slept all night, but you didn't actually sleep all night. If that makes any sense. All I can hear is Zoe going, no girl, no girl. <laughs> that cat, man. She is just itching to get into stuff. She was trying to get behind my laptop and bite some wires this morning. Poor thing though, last night she was so scared of the fireworks. It was just neighbors going off because we had ours on Tuesday. She was right next to me huddled in this little ball, which is really awkward for her right now. She's almost five months old now and she's all limbs. Like she's all long legs and, and whatnot. So it's very hard. Hi, Melissa. How are you? Oh, no, Jolene, I'm doomed. That's what you're telling me. You're telling me I'm doomed. To get more into my Neverwhere book, I will. I will read the President is Missing um, soon after I finish Neverwhere. As many whips as I just went through, guys, I can only read one book at a time. That's all I can do. Just one book at a time. I can't do anymore. I feel kind of bad, but. I'm weird. Let's do a little shadow. So let's get I got my pasta. I set my books all on top of my spare paper. Shame. Shame. So this one, I think I'm actually going to go over with markers because I'm really not liking it. And I actually think these are going to be the two markers that I use. The light indigo and the lilac. But we'll see. We'll see. Shake it like you mean it. Oh, well, that's cool, Melissa. Hi, Lisa. How are you? sure it's working. There we go. Get the little dots going. There we go. All right. I love these. I love these flowers. That is cool. Yeah, the neighbor kids. We sat out with the neighbor kids and um, their mom and dad. We sat out with them. Yes, no, not yesterday. Day before. Tuesday night. I can't think, guys. I'm telling you, my brain is mush. Absolute stinking mush. So 
I tried fixing this pencil by the way it's in there it's in my thing that's why I'm looking at it this yellow ochre seriously I can pull out the uh, the lead on it and pull it out I can push it it's really bad it melted on its way here it's supposed to be really nice pencils but I can't use it if it won't stay in. <laughs> you know, the Pharisee fireworks, the heat never broke. Oh, isn't it terrible? Oh, you got sunburn, April? I can't do large crowds. I tried. So when we first moved here, um, we had moved here, I think, July 2nd or something. So my husband was like, oh, they're having fireworks downtown. Let's go downtown and look at the fire and watch the fireworks. It's like, okay, let's go do that. 150,000 people later, I was freaking out. I'm just like, can we just go home? We can just go home, right? He's like, no, we're here. All right. It's like, but if we lose the kids, I'm calling. <laughs> it's on you. Because that's my, that's really the thing that drives me the most is I worry about losing the kids. Because, um, you know, Zoe runs off. That's just what she does. Sorry, I'm reaching over here. Oh. <sighs> No, April, that's a good idea, though. Yes, Melissa, there was so many people. I was so done. By the end of the night, I was like, I can't go anywhere tomorrow. I can't look at people. Like, I need to go to the store. Not happening. Not happening. It, uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know why it does it. Like it melted, it melted a little bit in transit. I can see where it melted. There's like a, I, I can't get it to focus. Weird. Weird happenings. I must have used two different Poscas because that one's way brighter than that one is. Oh, speaking of hot gluing, my daughter's birthdays are coming up and the youngest wants a Harry Potter unicorn birthday. So I'm thinking about making some Harry Potter wands to give out to the kids using hot glue and paint and uh, chopsticks. I think that might be fun. I hope that might be fun. You never know. Kids are finicky. If I can get her to get, if I can get my oldest on board with it, that's the problem. Is getting the oldest one on board. I think it would be cool. I know I'd like that birthday party. And who wouldn't? Want a Harry Potter birthday party? Just saying. It's convincing the soon to be eight year old. What is that cat? Oh, good. She's got one of her mice. Finally. I've been trying to get her to play with those mice all stinking day. All, well, day. I say day. It's morning. All morning. No, she wouldn't do it earlier. She's been trying to climb my curtains. She's been into everything. She likes climbing 
and do the um, into the covers and then laying next to me I was like no you've got to because I'll roll over on her so that's that's another part of I'm not sleeping very well is I'm getting woke up in the middle of the night by a cat I have to watch out for so that I don't roll over on her I know, May. Probably Kaylee. Kaylee probably wouldn't like it. She may have to suck it up. Buttercup. And then she's already asking for a separate party. Their birthdays are five days apart. I don't want to do a separate party. It's way too much work. I don't actually want to do the party that she wants me to do right now. I'll do it. And then, so I was going to rent the pool house, the HOA uh, clubhouse, which is at the pool. Except for they said that the pool isn't included in the rental. Like, I can't let my guests go to the pool. And that seems really stupid. So my neighbor was like, well, you're inviting us, right? And I said, yeah. She goes, so your husband has four guests. You have four guests. I'll take four guests. My husband will take four guests. And he goes, she's like, and you can invite the neighbor across the street and she can have four guests. I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> she's like, we'll do this party. An eraser on the end that would work too, except I don't have any of those. I'll have to see if my uh, my oldest does from school. I don't have any eraser ends. I have a lot of the art erasers, but I don't have any like eraser erasers, which seems silly now that I think about it. We got storms. Yeah, we had we had almost we had rain so big it looked like hail. We actually had to go out and like look at it to make sure it wasn't damaging our cars. It was just so it was just big heavy raindrops. It went on for probably about fifteen minutes and then that was about it. That's all she wrote. Didn't dampen anybody's fireworks displays, unfortunately. I just think the fireworks should be left to the professionals. And we had a shoot Tuesday, and there was, it was a festival and fireworks at the high school. And dude, at the end of my street at the cul-de-sac had to have the fire trucks come up because he had started like a fire in his backyard. It's like awesome. I think this weekend my kids don't have any swim lessons because the the lady's off so I think this weekend I'm gonna be catching up on some sleep like leave me alone I'll get up at 10 o'clock I'll turn off my medicine alarm so it doesn't wake me up at 9 and then I will just sleep 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 try to make that up Hi, Evelyn. How are you? So, I'm curious. How many of you guys have more than one uh, work in progress going at a time? Like, I'm... What I have right now is actually a lot for me. 
which is why I'm kind of feeling slightly overwhelmed at the moment. Um, like two or three I'm pretty cool with. And the ones in here I'm not really counting because I've always got something going on in here. Um, like how many of you guys work on multiple pictures at a time? Oh, Kenneth. Yeah. Robin, you have about six coloring slumps. Oh, I hate when that happens. April's got four. Melissa's got more than 30. Evelyn's got a few. Okay, well, as long as I'm not the only one. I know May is only doing one. when you can finish them in a day that's not that's not jealousy you hear my problem is I can't just sit and do this um, when I'm not on stream because no matter what somebody needs me my husband needs me the cat needs me the house needs me the kids need me something needs me so I can't just sit here and color. And I hate picking up, setting down, picking up, setting down. I hate that back and forth. So every now and then, like, I just, I don't get to work on something for a while. What are you doing? That cat. Most fears are from Kirby. May does max at two at a time. Kevin's got about four. Yeah, I can't work on just one. But also, I can't, like, the eight or ten or whatever I've got going now is just too many for me. So I'm trying to knock it down. I didn't see that. There's a little under part right there of the flower. There's that. Look at that under part. I'm going to go in with the passion fruit. And then blood orange. And a little coral to round it all out. There. Hi Katrina. Hi Lizzie. Am I missing anybody else? Hi everybody coming in. Hope you're doing well. I'm going to work on this little little guy over here, let me get his yellow innards first. How's everybody doing? So, just FYI, guys, I should be getting here soon. Um, the Camillo de Erico Mermaids book, which I, I bought two. So, one for me and one to give away. So, I should be having that here soon. Um, Amazon updated me and said that they will be shipping it out so that I will have it by the 10th which I love for the Amazon pre-orders that they ship it out so that you have it on release day instead of shipping it on release day. Watching Wimbledon. Wow. I've been thinking about making some videos. I don't think I can handle a live stream. 
Oh, I prefer the live streams. Sorry, I'm resettling myself. I prefer the live streams to just recording because just recording, I'm just sitting there talking to myself. And I feel like a weirdo. So. May have to sharpen here. Getting into some small spots. Yeah, I'm not very good at just recording. I prefer the live streams. I prefer the interaction and the the camaraderie and not feeling like I'm talking to an empty room. Shaleen back. Welcome back. Oh, there you go. There you go, Melissa. I bet I could make something with Kaylee. She would like it. But only for the first ten minutes. And then she'd get bored. And walk away. And leave me just hanging. Because that's the kind of kid she is. I love her to bits, but... Anything needing any type of attention span is a no-go. I'm actually pretty amazed. She, I don't know if you guys follow me on Instagram. I'm pretty sure I have the link in the description. Um, I'm actually really surprised. I'm just listening, so she's chewing, chewing her down. Um, I'm amazed she finished those circle portraits, because um, normally she doesn't sit and finish a page. I mean, she can draw a page, and she'll sit and finish a whole drawing, but like sitting and coloring a page is not a thing she does. Um. Uh, this is um just nova yeah the live stream has more interaction oh kenneth that's okay they're all they're all on recordings too so watch it when you can i i can't make everybody's live stream either i feel bad And there's been a few times where I just didn't have the, the energy to interact. Hi, Elizabeth. I'm sorry, guys. I'm really flipping tired. <laughs> like, I don't... I don't understand. Oh, I need a finish. Let's get out the Posca. Posca, Posca, Posca. Oh, this is the little one. I was using the big one. What am I doing? She's watching Dora. We did it. We did it. Swiper. No swiping. There we go. Ready, bitty little dots. Thank you, April. Oh, nice, Kenneth. Oh, Katrina, the book I'm giving away is the Camilla de Erico Mermaids, the new one. The new Mermaids book.
So I'll be doing that when it comes in, uh, which should be, I should get it like on July 10th. So. Oh, did they, Lizzie? Oh, cool. I didn't, I didn't ask for a new set. I probably should have, but eh. I did get back, I'm, I need to sharpen. So I did contact um, Lyra again. I found out that it's been since February that I first contacted. I'm like, I still don't have the pencils you were going to send me because I had like two inches of flipping. I had like this much core just like come out of the pencil after sharpening it. So they said they were going to send me... They said they were going to send me replacements of those two pencils, and I still haven't gotten it, so I emailed her yesterday. So maybe I'll hear back something today. I did find out Arteza is in development for um, more pencils so that they will have up to 120 count. So that's something to look forward to in the future. They did not have an ETA on that. They just said it was in development. So that's something to look forward to. Um, May, I have to check something on that, sweetie. So just don't worry about it. Oh, I missed something. I'm sorry, guys. I was... Oh, cool, Lizzie. Oh, get him back again, Shalene. Did you go through the um, web page? The contact form on the web page. Try again. Because everybody I've talked to, I say everybody, I've only talked to like three people. Um, but everybody I've talked to have been really helpful. I wonder if you just had like a bum, a bum person. Which happens? Are they bad days or what have you? I've worked in a call center where there were days where I unless you specifically asked me something I wasn't gonna go out of my way I know that's bad but I mean it's human nature okay May yeah just I'm not certain but just hold off on that I need to check ah oh weird Yeah, I went through their contact page on their website because I had bought through Amazon. That's weird, Shaleen. Maybe they're like, oh, since it was free, you know, tough cookies, which is like ridiculous, but still. I can see that being the company stance too, unfortunately. April. I have got that on my wish list. I'm waiting for it. I haven't seen any flip throughs of it and I keep looking for them hoping somebody maybe got an advanced copy or something but I I am really excited from the few bits I did see of it on just on Amazon 
I mean, yeah, it kind of has like a Kirby vibe, but I didn't get the same like um, straight up copy that I got out of that um, that fairy doodle book. So I'm hoping it's not a straight up copy. I assume if they're going through a publisher and not self-publishing through Create Space, that it will have a higher standard than that other book did that was very rip-off of Kirby. So that's my hopes. Since it's going through a publisher, you have to, you know, you have to abide by copyright laws more so than if you, you know, just. I had to spray her a million billion times yesterday for jumping on my curtains. She's just in one of those moods, honey. Oh, better check on her. Yep, better check on her. Okay. Oh yeah. Oh April. I'm seriously because it that's been um I figure since it's been uh, put through a publisher, you know, somebody's looked into it, you know? What Hannah Carl's on copy? Who's got a copy of Hannah Carl's on? You saying somebody ripped off the artwork? I've seen a few not great copies yeah if it's gonna be in Target there's no way it can be a dead a dead ringer for the Kirby books but I'm so excited like I'm super excited for something along the lines of Kirby I love Kirby to death I love his books But if there's some new blood, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go for it, too. Just remember her posts about being sold. Oh, man. Hi, Amanda. Yeah, I'm excited for that that mythographic book. That should be something. Hmm. How do I want to do the underside? I didn't see that. That's a little flipped up, flipped back. Thank you, May. May come to the rescue with Lynx. I've got so much stuff that I'm like waiting on. I'm waiting on my handyman to get in contact with me to put in my microwave. I'm waiting on Lowe's to tell me that my fridge and stove are in. I ordered back in April. I ordered back in April uh, a new stove and fridge. Well, I ordered four piece. I've got everything but the stove and fridge now. And they're still saying, so the original install date was supposed to be June the 11th, which was fine. We would have just moved in. All good. Now they're saying July 11th. I'm like, 
You guys do realize I'm sitting here with a range that doesn't fully work properly and a stove that doesn't fully, or yeah, stove that doesn't fully work properly and a fridge that barely holds enough food for four people. Never mind that I've got company incoming this month. I'm just like, I need my stuff. Fantastic images. Fantastic arts. Ooh, I'll have to check that out. Thank you, Elizabeth. Hi, Lori. How are you? Anybody you've missed coming in? I hope I haven't missed anybody. I tried not to. But I am human. I swear. I promise. I think so. Not been told otherwise. I'm just ignoring the the dots on here. Since I'm doing it with a Posca, I don't feel the need to make sure I get it. I'm doing good, Lori. I'm tired. How are you? I just saw some of the in images. I know, isn't it cool? I'm sleepy. Oh, Lori. When when does the mythographic come out, guys? You guys that are looking at it. When does it come out again? I haven't looked. Is it August? Oh, September. Okay, well then I'll I'll wait to pre-order it until then. Until the end of August. Because Amazon always, I like, I hate that they do this. That they don't deduct the money until it ships. Like that really, really bothers me on on an, a very fundamental level. <laughs> it really, really super bothers me. I'm just like, just take the money. And if something happens and it doesn't ship, then refund the money. Like, can we not? Because then I've got like this hold on money. I have to remember that X hasn't shipped yet. And I've, I've got X amount waiting to be gone. I just can't. I can't do that. It hurts my brain. Fantastic. I'm going to have to, give me just a second, guys. So I don't forget, I'm going to go to his Instagram here. There we go. I was going to say, he looks just like Kirby, but no, that's Kirby. <laughs> Uh, look at this. Look at that. 
How cool is that? I like look. He does have a very Kirby-esque feel. But it's different. I like it. How cool. Look at that. All right. Yep. I want the book. I want the book. Is that not just the coolest thing ever? That was right up my alley. <laughs> Good. Hopefully he's inspired to make another book. Just saying. Because one cannot have too many coloring books, right? Right, guys? Yep, definitely your birthday. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, they are inspired by the same things. But that's okay, because they both have different interpretations, which I think is really cool. to go I was just looking out my window I'm gonna have to go spray off my porch at some point because there's puggies all over it all right so I'm done with those Oops. get the white dots on Right now, we're cooking. Well, wasn't he? Wasn't there a rumor that he was going to publish one after Geomorphia separately, not with the same publisher? Bear in mind, I did say rumor. It's not going to be. Hi, Zargot. That's all right. Amanda, it's not going to be any different. All right, so that's a good in lilac. Let's get one more purple. Do I want to go pinky purple or do I want to go blue purple? Let's go blue purple. Purple violet. No. No. X nay on the purple violet. Crimson? Mm. I'll work with it for now. I 
and get that back in there. There we go. Hi, girly pants. Have fun, April. Oh no, I, Amanda, I've got four, four Metamorphia books, because you know, you can't, can't have just one. All right, I'm gonna try this out. Deep breath, everybody. All right. Oh, I'm bad, Amanda. It does suck that the English version is so thin. That's why I'm, I'm not coloring. I'm coloring in the Norwegian version. What looks greasy? Really? Really, Zarka? Greasy? Kill me. <laughs> yeah, okay, it looks greasy. I mean, great. I mean... You silly. Let's see. No, I don't think that would work. Ice blue. No. That's too bluey blue. Sky blue. Better. I can do that. So let's do. She said, Well, shooty pants. I'm just going to have to roll with it. It's just going to be what it bees. Maybe it'll dry different. Alright, so I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten of these big ones. How jarring is that actually going to be? I'm coloring with pit pens. A, oh, a duck cooking. I thought you were saying duck coloring. Well, what are you doing? Hi, Erica. Yeah, they're pit pens. So I'm coloring with lilac, crimson, uh, light indigo, and uh, sky blue. If 
but I'm thinking about flipping out the indigo for something else. Maybe not. Yeah. Now, I'm really just unhappy with this color combination. I'm just going to have to bite it and just go with it. Um, so, let's just do it. What is that cat doing? What's that cat doing? Are you spraying her to get down? Okay. Hmm. I wonder what it feels like to not be listened to. That's so weird. She says the cat's not listening to her. You can tell how much sympathy I have, right? Alright. I guess I'll be okay. No, not really. Um, Amanda, you just don't use don't use a ton of layers. Um, where am I? I'm about right here. I'm glad you like it, Shalene. I I like it. I just don't like it for this page. Um, so it wasn't quite the look I was going for. But it's done now. I like the crimson and lilac, and I like the lilac and the indigo, the light indigo. Elizabeth, I love your confidence. Hi, Linda. Oh, see, I like orange and blue together. Those are my, that's orange and teal. That's my color zone. How are you guys doing? Let's see, what am I doing? What am I doing? That's why I put this page to the size because I didn't like the way this flower was coming out. I wanted to have it like an Alphonse Mucha Mucha painting, but eh. It is what it is. Sounds like there's rain, but I don't see any rain. Yep, Zomjus Nova. Thank you, Lizzie. At least it'll go faster now with markers, right? <laughs> I'm so slow. I'm such a slow color, so it's terrible. I feel bad. You have to, if you're going to blend, you've got to move it while they're still wet. Otherwise, you won't be able to. 
Thanks, Argot. Thanks, Elizabeth. I like the swords, too. What was I doing? I got confused. Some kids outside aren't playing with little bottle rockets or anything. That would be bad. Yay! <laughs> Yay, I finished one. Let's see. Are you giving me back the spray? Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, she listens to you now? Yeah. Oh, good. Is that what she was like? Yeah. She was like <laughs> that silly old cat. Yeah. She was just staring at me and then she turned away. Yeah. Silly kitty. I think Zoe just likes that there's the, the fact that there's some something else in the house that gets told no more than she does. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not looking at chat right now. I will look at chat in a minute. Like I said, you can't let these dry. Otherwise, you can't move. You can't blend it. There. All right. Oh, thanks, girly. Is there a way to see what subscribes watched you live if they don't? No, Kylara, there is not. And welcome, by the way. I'm sorry I didn't see you come in. How can you see them as participants, Zargot? I haven't looked in. I honestly haven't looked into it. So, um, but yeah, if you like hover over the likes or if you hover over the watched or whatever, um. So, oh, that happens all the time. Sometimes I assume that those are people who are coming in from the recommended page. Um, and so they're just checking it out to see what it is. And aren't necessarily colorists. And then there are some people like me where I... I you know, click on and then walk away because something needed my attention. And so I won't say anything the entire stream, even though I was kind of there. Nope, no bleed through, Evelyn. So you see right there and right there. So that's roughly right in this general area, and I have absolutely zero bleed through. As long as you don't, like, overdo it and try to go over the same spot multiple times. If you start to the point where you're about to pill the paper, or you, well, I shouldn't say about to, where you are pilling the paper, it is much more likely that you have gone through the page. Um, because you have now saturated that paper. So 
So those two, absolutely no, no shadowing, no go through, no nothing. Yeah, Kimberly, I I don't, I have absolutely no issue with people just lurking. Um, it is what it is, because I do it a lot too. So I can't take issue with something that I do. Just my, my two cents. Oh good, she found her mouse. I know I'm going fast. Sorry, guys. Wait, no, I need this one. When I'm typically by myself, this is how I work with markers. I just flip them out like this, same as I do my pencils. So by the end of the day, typically right around here, I tend to have <laughs> I tend to have a lot of uh, marker marks. And my husband's like, "What'd you do to yourself?" Well, I was coloring, you see. So these are, are pretty stiff markers. I don't know if you can see. Those are pretty stiff ends. Um, but after some use, they do soften up. So if you want that like really fine point, you kind of have to work for it. And by work for it, I mean really lightly press. What? Whose channel? Crystalline Art. Oh, cool, Elizabeth. Yeah, there's sometimes I have nothing to contribute to the chat either. Either there's a lot of people talking and I can't keep up. Or they're, you know, they're doing something that either I already know how to do or I have no desire at that moment to learn what they're doing. I'm also really bad about not commenting on videos that I watch. I really am just an all-around bad YouTuber. Sorry. Terrible person. I should comment more and I should... But... I just forget. And I usually have it on autoplay, so it just kind of goes. And it's in the background. And I forget. I'm a terrible person. Please forgive me. <laughs> Thanks, Lizzie. <coughs> So Kyla, it's really difficult to figure out like when is it, when's the best time to stream and when um, when you're going to get the most people and whatnot. Um, I have always streamed at this time, and seriously, at first I had zero people. I was streaming and there was nobody here, or they would pop in and then leave, and I was just sitting here talking to myself. Um, I have eventually built up. 
a viewership um, that come can come in when I stream, but a lot of people that watch me, they can't. And I feel bad, <clears throat> but this is the time that works best for me. I worked it around me. I didn't work it around other people. <clears throat> oh, I always hit the like button. Like, if you check out my um, Twitter, like, it's, it's nothing but you, Melissa liked this video. Melissa liked this video. <laughs> All right, Evelyn, have fun. Bye, Amanda. Yeah, so, I mean, you can, like, try to micromanage that, but I, I just, I don't find that to be worth it for me. Also, um, I'm pretty sure I still have it linked in here, Kylara, is the days and times that everybody streams that April Sarah made a, um, made a, a sheet for. Oh yeah, I still talked, but I did go silent on, on occasion. Oh, okay, Evelyn. I understand that. I do that, too. Why would somebody block? Uh, unless you're, like, being rude. I don't necessarily see a reason. And you don't seem rude to me, Kevin, so I could be wrong. Maybe you are rude. Maybe we're all rude. We just don't know it. What do you think about that? Do, 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 do. Tonight on the Twilight Zone. Yeah, Zargot. I mean, it just. Oh, Dee Dee. Dee Dee is one. One heavy streamer. She used to be on Ustream and I couldn't watch her on Ustream. And I don't catch her typically on, on YouTube either because those are like my days off. And so I'm usually doing laundry and dishes and, you know, meal planning and all that other stuff. So, like, I don't really catch Dee Dee. And sometimes a girl's got to mow a lawn. Yeah, that's the other problem with really big streams is then you can't get a word in, it feels like. Or if you do get a word in, you, you look away and then whoever answered you is like gone and you have to like try to scroll back through. It's very difficult. Try to be positive with all people. Thanks, Kenneth. <laughs> yeah. Some people, you know, you know, I, I get it. Um, I always say that tone and intonation do not travel via text. Um, and people have to watch out for that your tone, your meaning, it doesn't travel well via text. There's no way to know somebody's true intentions with their words. So I can understand, you know, misunderstandings or whatever, but if you don't attempt to find out what is a, trying to be said, then what's the point? Block because, oh, I don't like what you said. Never mind that it wasn't meant that way or it wasn't you know, wasn't actually rude, it's just the way they took it. So just FYI, if you ever have a question about the way I say something, I try to speak online with 
the knowledge that not everybody gets me. Not everybody gets my humor. Not everybody gets my tone. But I've worked very, very, very hard to cultivate a tone that flows well online. But if you ever have a question about what I'm saying or the way it's said or it, it came across wrong and you just want clarification, please, 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 please ask me. I will never, ever, 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 ever be mad that you asked. Just laying that out there. It does. Like I have to, every now and then I have to scroll and make sure I didn't miss anything. So. Hi Elizabeth, how are you? I'm going to be like Ann and sing my highs now. Sorry, sorry Ann. My bad. I may have watched Ann last night, so... And I'm, I'm really bad just also, I'm really, really bad at picking up things. Um, it's, my, it's my way of making friendships as I pick up things that other people do. And it comes across as mimicking, but I'm really not mimicking on purpose. <laughs> it's, it's an accident. <laughs> it's, a, it's a mechanism to make friends. Um, so if I mimic somebody's greeting or if I mimic somebody's way of speech, I'm really, really sorry. That's my way of saying I like you. I like you enough to listen to you enough to have picked up something from you. Thanks, Lizzie. No, I promise not to be mad, May. For the most part. I'm going to add that for May. For the most part. <laughs> <laughs> Who does what? Oh, we're talking Dee Dee still. I did, Elizabeth. Did you? I didn't do anything on the fourth. I did stuff on the third. Uh, we had our fireworks here on the third. Did you have a good fourth? I did grill out hamburgers yesterday. <gasps> I've got hamburgers for lunch. I made them all so I could have leftovers. Because believe it or not, a reheated grilled hamburger is delish. Just saying. If you ever need a quick lunch, I need to shut the kids up. Cool. Thank you, Linda. You're awesome, too. Awesome sauce. I know, Kyler. I do the same thing. I, You know what? I, I wonder the same thing, too. Like, my next-door neighbor is super country. She has a very, very thick country accent and when I'm talking to her I start getting a draw on everything and I feel very bad because I'm very I'm very subconscious of it or very conscious of it and uh I I've told her already I'm like look I'm not making fun of you I'm just it's just how I am <laughs> and she's like oh it's all right I'm like okay thanks thanks charity Yep. I agree, May. You don't have to go to... I, I, the, the idea that you have to go to every stream also, I think, is kind of ridiculous. I don't expect everybody to show up at my stream that shows up to other people's streams. I, I don't. Heck, I don't expect all my subscribers to be able to show up to all my streams. It just, it's not a thing that can happen. P 
people have lives. Things happen. You know what? And sometimes I don't agree with some of the things that the streamers say. And so, you know, I just, instead of making a deal about it, I just leave it be. Unless, like, they're wholly inaccurate and, you know, really going to mess some people up. <laughs> no, Kyler, I can't control it either. I'm glad I'm not the only one, though. No, if I'm if I'm home, if I've got my computer, and sometimes if I'm somewhere where I can, I don't need to pay attention to my phone. I'll turn on streams just so they get the counts or whatever, the the watches, because I know that that it makes some people feel really good. Just getting, just having somebody there, and not talking to the void. Um, yeah, that can help. So I try to I try to make as many streams as possible, but A, YouTube doesn't always tell me. B, I don't always have the time, but I try. I don't talk in most of them, but I'm there. Oh, thank you, Melissa. Ninety-five yesterday. Yep. I agree, May. I think it's the same one I stopped going to. But. Everybody's allowed their differences. I don't think I've unsubbed from anybody. I think I've left my sub counts the same. Some I just don't watch. And some, I mean, bless their hearts, they're very sweet and everything. But there's not a whole lot I can learn from them. So, I've got that going too. So sometimes those I'll just have playing on on mute or something. So they have the accounts, but you know, there's not a whole lot I can add to the conversation. But most of the time it's just because I'm busy. I'm doing dishes and laundry and cleaning house and grocery shopping and coloring and all that other fun stuff. I can't just always sit and chat. I've got stuff to do, things to see. Mostly mouths to feed. Yeah, so I'm streaming pretty late, or really early. Kylara, just when you can. If, if that's what you want to do, just do it when you can. Let's see, I've got one, one, two, three, four, five left. I'm at an hour and 30. Does Sammy stream today? No, Sammy doesn't stream today. I don't think I've got anybody I've got to watch out for for today. I missed Sammy's stream yet, or Tuesday. I forget. Oh, I had to go make uh, Rice Krispie treats. Freedom treats. That's what I had to make. Freedom treats. That's what I call them. 
because I put on red, white, and blue sprinkles. They were freedom treats. Yeah, I think she only streams Thursdays when she can't stream on Saturday or she didn't stream on Tuesday, but she did stream on Tuesday, so I think I'm good. And if I see it pop up, I'll hop off. Mostly, I'm having a good time. Are you having a good time? For some reason, I have Mr. Rogers in my head now. Won't you be my neighbor? Thanks, Kylara. I can't wait to see it finished either. <laughs> I can't. I want to be done with this. I don't know what I was thinking. What was I thinking? I was thinking, oh, this would be so much fun. It is. It's actually fun. As much as I have a hard time finishing pages, I really do enjoy them. Oh, is she Coloru? Thank you. Well, then I'll finish up here in about 30 minutes. Thank you, Coloru. You rock. Good to know. Yeah, the time zone thing is, is hard, too, on some people. And God, when, like, May and Zargot show up, I'm just like, oh my god, guys, go to bed. It's like 10 o'clock in my time. Like, go to bed. I feel like their moms, go to bed. What are you doing awake? According to the Google Doc. Okay. For some reason I thought it was Tuesday and Saturday. Yeah, after I leave here I have to go take a shower. And because I'm a gross person I haven't showered yet today. The cat woke me up at 6 a.m. And I just don't want to do it. Um, that's my excuse and I'm sticking to it. So I have to shower and then I have to go to the store because I need some stuff for Taco Tuesday on a Thursday. And I really hate going to the store after lunch. you Elizabeth yeah oh, okay Lizzie I gotcha Prisma colors open stock dick Blick, Elizabeth they're um, they're the ones I have found the best price decent shipping um, yeah so Dick Blick is where I would go for open stock Prismas in the U.S. I think Colt Pens in the U.K.? I don't know. You'd have to check around. I, don't, I haven't... That's not my area of expertise. I'm not from the U.K., so I don't, I don't actually know anything. No, it was Tuesday. I know she's Tuesday. It's very confusing. There's so many of us now. That cat is scratching on something. I don't know what it is. Oh, it's the rug. That's okay.
You know what's funny is anytime anybody says Dick Blick, um, YouTube decides to like hide it and filter it. I know, Linda, that's terrible. I've got a Tuesday morning. But that mine doesn't have a, good, a lot of good stuff, I should say. What am I doing? Thanks, Lori. Have a good day. I probably did, Zargot. Yeah, I'm going to have to do that. I've got a little blue thingy at the top of my YouTube thing that says you can filter words. So I'll have to cl click that. Um, after the stream and take off the filter because here's the thing y'all I have a bad potty mouth I don't actually care if anybody else has a bad potty mouth it does not bother me so just FYI but I keep my mouth clean for the kids mostly I did I did slip that one day I slipped hard Oh my god. I still can't believe I did that. Uh, as I was talking at the dinner table one night, I was, I was telling my husband about these flipping something or other. And so he just goes, those flipping blah blah blah. I'm just like, oh my god. My husband just goes, mother of the year. Way to go. Yep. Oh, May. It was terrible. It was horrible. Thank you, Barbie. It was terrible. Ah. Uh, I thought I caught myself, too. Nope. I went back and watched. I was like, no. <laughs> uh, I'm really bad, too. Like, I've slipped up in front of the kids, and I turned and said, that's a bad word. You don't say that. <laughs> they all look at me like, oh, did mommy just say that? And then they, they tell Dave when he gets home and he just looks at me and I'm like, I can't help it. So I've gone 30 plus years without having to have a filter on this mouth, okay? You expect me to just like have one in seven years? Like it's not going to happen. Night, Kylara. Bye. <laughs> she needs volunteers shipping volunteers shipping to Australia is as bad as shipping to Norway just saying not quite as bad but still bad My boys learned if the F bomb came out, then they had really pushed all the limits. And they <laughs> now, see, I use cursing. Sorry, I had to take a drink. I curse because I have no other way to express my anger. It's either that or I hit something. Or, conversely, I am cursing because I'm so freaking happy. <laughs> it's one or the other. Either it's awesome or it's really crap. And there's no, like, in-between. Like, if I'm just talking about something, it is what it is and I can just talk about it. But if I'm really happy about something, I'm cursing. And if I'm really mad about something, I'm cursing. So. Oh no, my mom cussed. My sister, I'm going to tell you this. My sister, when she was little, 
gosh, she had to have been like three, maybe four. My mom had washed her shoes. She'd gotten them all muddy. We were in the creek and everything. She'd gotten them all muddy, so my mom washed her shoes. And she goes to put them on the next day. And she goes, she has a southern, she has a southern drawl because she was born in South Carolina. She goes, shit, mom, you shrunk my shoes. <laughs> To this day, to this day, my mom still brings it up. She goes, I couldn't punish you. She's like, there was nothing I could do but just stand there and laugh. <laughs> and it was terrible. And she was just this little kid. And my mom was like, I couldn't do anything. She was like, I know exactly where she got it. She was like, I know she got it from me. She was like, so I couldn't get mad. But I, I've had my mouth washed out with soap a few times for my mom. And she would, what she would do is she had a special toothbrush for you. And she'd rub it against the soap bar and make you go brush your teeth with soap. It was terrible. So I learned to keep my mouth shut around her. She was like, you never really talked as a teenager. I'm like, yeah, because otherwise I would have cussed up a storm and I had my mouth washed out. She goes, really? She's like, you could have cussed. I said, no, I couldn't. I said, Jamie could. Tom, you wouldn't know what to do with if he did. I said, I couldn't. You'd have washed my mouth out. She goes, no, I wouldn't. I said, yeah, you would. Don't give me that BS. Now she cusses up a storm. I have to tell her to watch her mouth in front of my kids. So, you know. I don't know where I got it from. Oh, May, that was in the 80s. There was no child abuse for that. I got a wooden spoon broken over my butt. That wasn't child abuse. That was parenting. Though what was really scary was when my dad took that old... He had this bass fishing belt buckle that was like this big, solid metal. He'd threaten to bust that across your bottom. That's when you paid attention. No. Like, I couldn't do that to my kids now. But, yeah. That was just what happened. It was just, that was just parenting. That's what everybody did. I had it better than some of the people who had Filipino moms. Jesus. Man alive. I don't know how those kids survived having a Filipino mom. I'm just going to like lay this out. Like I don't know how those kids survived. Those moms would come at them running with switches. If they did something. And you just see them hauling butt down the back of the um, the trail behind the houses. Into the woods. And you know they still got it when they got home too. Oh well. Yeah, color her back in the day. It was called punishment. Kids don't know how, how easy they got it. Look at me. Well, my dad would threaten us every now and then with his, uh, uh, the military sword, his marine sword, dress uniform sword. It was blunt, but we didn't know it at the time. If we did, we were really bad. Like he would pull it out and then shine it, and you'd like hid cowering in your room under the bed, just praying he didn't come in. He never did because my dad was never the punisher. He was just the big scary guy. It's like the boogeyman. Right, Barbie. Oh no, my mom like my mom popped me in the back of the head one day. I was like, 
what the? It's like, I'm like 30 something years old. She was like, you're not too old. <laughs> Thanks, mom. Yes, pumpkin pie. Can I watch Stampy on the TV? Yeah. Have you had any breakfast? No. Why don't you eat some breakfast first before it's too late to have breakfast? Okay. Okay? Yeah, I just don't know what to eat. Cereal. Okay. That cat's going crazy. I need to give her her medicine, but she's got to calm down before I can. Well, why'd you make her not calm? I don't know. I just can't No, it's all your fault, kid. Why'd you do that? <laughs> ah. Oh, yeah, if you, what is it? So one of my neighbors, her mom would make her go get switches. And, like, one time I was like, why don't you just take this? It's, you know, it's dry, it'll break, and then, you know, whatever. She was like, no, no, I can't do that. It'll be so much worse. I was like, oh, okay. Now I got wooden spoons. Those bamboo spoons you cook with. Mom broke one on my butt. Yeah, so if you do follow me on Twitter and all of a sudden you start seeing all these, like, Minecraft videos, that's my kids. They're using my... Yes, pumpkin. No, it's not quite time to go play with friends yet. Okay? I love you. Love you too. What you doing? Baby. Waiting for what? Okay. I don't know what she was waiting for. So my husband busted out last night. He's like, yeah, so uh, we've got this town hall at like 8.30 a.m. next Tuesday. He was like, they never have it at 8.30. It's never not catered. And this one won't be catered. He was like, something bad is happening. He was like, so if I get laid off, next week. I'm really sorry. He was like, but plus side, I'll get three months severance. I'm like, oh, awesome. We just bought a house. That's so cool. <laughs> it's like, oh, Jesus. So now he's got me freaking out. Trying to get a retailer. That that'd be cool, girly. Get a retailer. Oh, I'm hitting up on two hours. I just want to finish these. Is that so bad? Is that bad? I just want to finish these flowers. Why are you telling her no while you're playing with her toy? You can't do that. Oh, it's okay. She can't really do any damage. She can't do any damage. Oh, it's going to go well here in just a minute with those kids. I can already tell. 
Zoe, that's enough. So conversely, I have to say, trying to bypass distributors, killer excuse of rights to market the product. I can't believe you guys lost access to Amazon. That's terrible. I haven't looked into that to read up on it yet. I keep meaning to and then other things like, you know, the liberal civil war that was supposed to happen yesterday. That, you know, that was fun. If you can't tell the sarcasm in my voice. only buy on Amazon AU, Amazon US, UK, Japan. So you can only buy on AU, not any of the other sites like you used to previously. Is that what I'm understanding? I'm sorry guys all right I got one more of these little flowers and then I'll be done and I'll leave because it's been over two hours what two hours forgot. Yeah, let's get to the last one and totally forget what we're doing. That sounds like an excellent idea. Oh, did I take my allergy medicine? I hope so. My eyes are itching. that price. That's absolutely ridiculous. I'm so sorry, you guys. What about from the Arteza website itself? Will they ship to the Australia? I know their prices are a little bit more, at least here in the U.S., but I don't know. Thank you, Barbie. US, UK only. Oh. I'm sorry. That's really, really sucky. Like, unimaginably sucky. Excellent, girly. I hope you get that fixed.
So is it strictly due to shipping costs or is there some other thing at play? Like, you know, tariffs and such. I'm just waiting for everything uh, to be banned to ship to the U.S. because, you know, we're going to charge tariffs on everything. We have such a stupid good deal on goods incoming to the U.S. And now we're just going to throw it all away. Because now you have a GST to be added. Ah. Uh. That's stinky. Super, super stinky. I'm sorry for Australia. I think this is it. Last bit. Last bit. Alright, hopefully overall that isn't too bad. There's a little more blue and purple than I necessarily wanted in this picture, but, you know, it is what it is. So, I am calling it there at two hours and seven minutes. Oh my goodness, I have to stretch. Hey, yard. Excuse me. Um, so thank you all for joining me. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Links down below to the items I have used. Um, and if you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment. Thank you all for joining me. And I will see you again on Tuesday. Bye-bye.